Okay, so here is the Boutonniere pin back sorter. As you can see, the circuit board is connected to the computer. Um, and basically we got two halves of a funnel here connected to two servos who are moving um, sort of outwards uh, at a periodic rate. And if we put these pin backs into the funnel, So we have power coming in to the microcontroller. We have five volt going to the positive. We have the positive and negative going from each servo. And then we have the controlling pin going from uh, into three and six. And then we have the whole thing going to ground. Um, that's how the servos are connected. And then we have um, the wire coming out from the servo uh, going all the way through each half of the funnel. Um, this gave it a lot of stability um, and allowed the, um, the wire not to rotate within the um, the little servo um, uh, connection. And then this piece, um, this piece slides so that you can easily um, catch the pin backs as they, as they fall. And it's just held together by a rubber band on both sides. Um, and then I, I put some painter's tape in there because the 3D print lines just weren't that good. Um, so I tried to make it a little bit more smooth so that the pins wouldn't get caught on that sort of stringing of the 3D printer. If one goes in sideways, it sort of gets stuck. And I played around with a bunch of different um, code, but if you were to make the opening wider, then um, like three or four would fall at a time. So it was whether I want one to get stuck or whether I want a couple to come out at the same time.